hello friends welcome to my channel this is kishore so in today's uh, tutorial we are going to discuss about uh, how to copy files from uh, dfs uh, system that is uh, hadoop storage layer to our local system okay so in my previous uh, video if you see uh, we have i have performed uh, how to save the files into hadoop uh, storage layer so these are the ta these are the steps i have performed in my previous video uh, so in today's uh, video i am going to show you uh, how to copy the files from hdfs layer to local so uh, currently we have some files uh, in hdfs layer we need to copy those files into our local system so in this case a local system means our uh, linux sda directory okay so this is my environment currently uh, i am having it so hadoop 1x architecture h1 n1 is the name node h1 n2 h1 n3 4 5 are data nodes and h1 n6 is secondary name node so i am going to start these services then i will uh, do the steps one by one i have already uh, started the nodes from one to six that is name node secondary name node remaining or data nodes okay so i have logged into uh, h1n1 uh, that is name node server as a hadoop user hdb user okay now if you want to see the services status you can just type jps so currently i don't have any services uh, running in my uh, cluster i will start the services one by one first i will start the name node hadoop.sh start name node okay so this is a command to start the name node hadoop diamond sh uh, start name node so if you see jps command now you can see name node service is running currently okay so now we have started the name node uh, let's start uh, the data nodes so the data nodes are uh, h h1n2 h1n3 h1n4 h1n5 so i am using clash command to uh, run these commands across the data nodes so how i can use it okay so here you go so i have defined uh, groups nn means uh, these commands only work on uh, name nodes dn is the group for data nodes ss snn is the secondary name node so i have defined already uh, groups here under groups we have uh, ip addresses uh, of the data nodes okay so now if i want to start the data node service uh, on my four nodes i will just use this command clash command then I will start the data nodes. So data nodes are started. Uh, currently uh, in uh, 165 server, my data node is uh, not installed. I mean, I have not installed Hadoop in, in that. So currently I have only three data nodes. If you see, initially when I explained about the architecture, I told you I have one name node, four data nodes, one secondary name node so the 65 i have not uh, installed i have not uh, taken it as a data node as of now only three data nodes currently running in my cluster okay so these three data nodes are we have already started now now we need to start the secondary name node let's execute this command okay secondary name node also started now if you want to see the status of all the nodes where all the services are currently running you can just execute uh, jps command across the nodes using clash
okay so uh, currently i have uh, five nodes running in my cluster uh, out of that one name node three data nodes and one secondary name node okay so i have started my uh, name node and data node secondary name node services currently these services are running up currently these services are up and running okay now uh, now our task is we need to copy the files from hdfs layer to our local system now before going to start that process let's see how many files are there in hdfs layer then we'll do the steps one by one okay to find out uh, how many files are uh, there in your uh, hdfs layer just use this command hadoop fsck hyphen files i think i have missed something let me just see here okay so i have not given the uh, directory where the hdfs directory i have not given i should give the hdfs directory so this command will give you how many uh, files are there in your hdfs uh, layer so currently i have a source file dot txt source file one dot txt source file two dot txt source file four dot txt currently i have four files uh, already there in the hdfs storage layer now i will copy all these uh, four files to my local system okay so uh, in my local uh, let me just uh, see how my what are the folders are there so this is a slash directory this is a local directory so here i have one folder called uh, kishore okay i will just go to my folder and i will see i don't have currently uh, any files in my folder okay now i'm going to copy this uh, hdfs uh, file hdfs uh, storage layer files into my local uh, kishore folder I will copy to my local okay okay so uh, if you want to uh, copy the files from hdfs to local we need to use get command so initially in in my previous video if you see i have used uh, i have used put command so put command is to copy the files from your local to hdfs get command is to get the files from hdfs layer to your local system okay now i have first step is completed i have already logged into uh, the nodes you can log into any node whether it is a data node or name node you can you can you can log into any node and you can perform these steps okay now i will i'm going to perform this uh, first step so there are three ways you can uh, copy the files from hdfs to local first one is hadoop fs hyphen get then hadoop hyphen a uh, hype sorry hadoop space dfs space hyphen get so these are uh, these are the two similar uh, commands we can use and we have one more uh, similar command hadoop space fs space copy to local so all these three commands perform the same operations okay let's try with this one first sudo uh, why i'm giving sudo here uh, because we are going to place the files in our local system so in our local system who is the uh, owner root root is the owner so for uh, root to get admin access to place the files into root directory we need to use sudo okay sudo is just like a admin access so i will just use sudo then hadoop fs hyphen get slash so this slash is the hdfs directory slash then i have source file 1.txt then i'm going to place this file in my local kishore directory okay it is successfully placed now uh, we will see whether uh, file is placed or not okay so if you see in my directory i can see source file 1.txt is placed so earlier uh, if you see uh, we did not get uh, 
any file names here now I can see source file one is copied so like that we'll do the other two similar ways looks like it is copied yeah so source file to dot txt also copied let's do the last way of uh, copying the file from sdfs to local using copy to local option okay it is copied okay so if you see uh, in my in my local system uh, that is kishore folder i have all these three files copied from hdfs layer so this is how you will copy the uh, files from hdfs uh, storage layer to your uh, local system so i will just uh, repeat the steps first we have to log into any admin node or data node servers with your uh, hadoop user uh, then you can create your uh, local folder where you want to copy the hdfs files then you can use any of these uh, commands to copy the files from hdfs to local so uh, this path is the hdfs path where your file is located in hdfs layer and this path is the uh, local uh, path that is where you want to copy the file okay <sighs> that's all guys for now uh, i will see you in the next video thank you bye